Let's uh, continue. Oh, it skipped the M18 drill driver. All right, let's look at the M18 t drill driver. The model for this is 2903-20, and the kit is 2903-22. The what comes in the kit is hard case, regular charger, two five amp hour batteries, and of course it comes with a handle. Let's see what the specs are. Most powerful drill, auto stop, 1,400 inch pounds of torque, fully half inch metal chuck, LED light, 21 RPMs, and what is the beats per minute for this? Oh, this is just the drill driver, there is no, it's not the hammer drill. So not too shabby. I can't wait to test this out too against its previous model. Because that's coming first. Like I have to test tools against their previous model to just find out if it's even worth the upgrade. But we'll see. We will see. What's he drilling into in that picture? He's going straight. I don't I have no clue what he's drilling into. He might be popping out one of the one of the caps. I do not know. You could do that while it's not the box is not attached to the to the wood. Alright, let's check out the hammer drill. Oh uh, hammer drill is the same thing, but let's check out the beats per minute. Specifications. The beat 33,000 beats per minute. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. I can't wait to test that out as well. Yeah, that clutch looks majorly different. That clutch looks majorly different. What does the clutch look like? It's it's a lot more round. I'd have to say the clutch looks more like uh like Makita's now. Yeah, the clutch looks like a, a, a little bit more like Makita's when it comes to the shape. Yeah, it's a much rounder clutch. Yeah. All right, so let's go back. Not too shabby. I can't wait to test these tools out, you guys. I cannot wait. All right, next, let's check out the M12 Fuel Quarter Inch X Impact Driver. Model number for this is 35, sorry, 3453 20. For the kit, it is. 3453-22. That this is I this looks darn good. I like that. I like that look. Too bad the handle though. The handle is so thick on these tools. For a 12 volt tool, it, uh, that is seriously it's a stem. No, that's seriously like a stick. Like a big stick. It's just just crazy. All right, so the model, like I said, uh, so let's check out the specs on this. Oh, uh, sorry for the for the kit, you get uh, two two amp hour batteries, charger bag, and the tool. Thirty six hundred RPM in mode three. It is like two pounds. It is two pounds? Not no, that's not bad. What other? Oh, specifications. 4,000 impacts per minute, 1,500 uh, inch pounds, 1 1.6 pounds, 3,600 RPM, and four uh, speed modes. I do not know if this, it's a quick answer collet or not. All right, let's see. Uh, drill driver, got that, got that, got that. Let's do, we're not going to go over everything, you guys. We, there's no need to. That's cool. It's just a remote control that you can wear as a watch. That's nice. Adapter for the remote control. Yeah, uh, Hilti actually has that too. We're not going to go over the vest. Let's go, uh, this is the 12-gallon wet dry vac tank. 
model number 0932-20. This is the USB stick light, red lithium. Let's see what the specs on this are. I'm just curious of the lumens, USB stick. 202, 202 degrees, 550 lumens, two hours of runtime with a three amp hour battery. 550 lumens is not that, this better be cheap. Like this should not be like 90 bucks. For 550 lumens, that's that better be a, a little cheaper. The model number for this is 2128-21. For the kit, you get the charger, USB port, battery, and the light. Not too shabby. All right, let's check out the M18 Fuel Utility Fencing Stapler. Of course, zero specs on this, or zero prices. This is going to be a pretty penny. 2843-20 or 2843-22. Uh, this comes with two 3 amp hour batteries, a regular charger, then the tool. I wonder how much staples you could hold in at once. Up to 600 staples per charge. That's just what it can do. What's the capacity? Up to 42% reduction time of peak. Six times faster. No gas. Up to 600 staples per charge. And I'm assuming that's with a 3 amp hour battery. Oh, let's see. F fires two staples per second. Tool free jam, clearing latch, and large touch points design specifications for use. LED work light featuring 200 red lithium battery technology. Yeah, like the, the power state, the power state motor is new. Reversible belt hook. Darn, it doesn't say what's the capacity. 15 inch. This is going to weigh 12.8 pounds, which that's not bad. That's not bad. Two, I'm sorry, guys. I do not know what the full capacity is of what this could actually hold at once. Only compatible with 1.5, 1.7, and 2-inch 9-gauge uh, galvanized staples. I'm sorry, guys. It does not say the capacity. Yeah, it doesn't say the capacity. I'm sorry about that, you guys. All right, so next let's go to the belt sander. All right, so the belt sander is 283-20. Uh, no kit, tool only. Dust bag, universal hose adapter, sanding belt. Let's go to the specs. This is 20 point, uh, sorry, 10.6 inches. There's five speeds. Service feet per minute, 1350 to 700. Belt size is 3 inches by 18 inches. S width is 6.3 inches, 5-year limited warranty. Uh, variable speed provides a range from 13,000, sorry, 1,350 uh, strokes per minute to 750 strokes per minute. Surface feet per minute, sorry. 1,350, uh, 1,350 surface feet per minute up to 750 surface feet per minute. So when it comes to belt sanders, the main issue that uh, it needs to be addressed is will the sandpaper stay on the tool? Or are you going to have to keep adjusting for it to go on? Let's say if you're doing this and then it starts to eventually slide itself off. So that, I'm pretty sure some YouTuber is going to put that to the test. And I heard that belts and boxes is going to do a race with it. So uh, tune in for that. We took care of that, took care of that, that. We have the M18 Fuel Quarter Inch Hex lock bolt, a lock bolt tool with one key. Comes with a catcher. What's the sizes that this requires? Up to 1,200 uh, lock bolts per charge. 
Installs up to 1,200 quarter-inch checks to alum magnet grip lock, uh, lock bolt fasteners and one M18TM Red Lithium XC 5 amp hour battery. That's not bad for a 5 amp hour battery. Uh, any other specs? Uh, brushless motor delivers 450 inch pounds. Sorry, 4,500 inch pounds. The lock bolt models are 99-7932. 7932 cc 99-2555, They got coming out with some new uh new gear. I can't wait to see the heated uh hoodie. The new heated vest. We'll we'll check those out during fall. I'm a huge fan of the M12 heated gear. But last but not least, let's check out the Milwaukee Packout. Let's see what is latest and greatest in the Packout. Uh, there's plenty of videos of this out already. So those are the new tools, you guys. I'm actually excited about this. We'll see how this actually is. And I am going to get some of these tools when I can, hopefully very soon. And I'm actually excited about it. So I can't wait to test out the M18 impact driver, hammer drill. Uh, is there a new reciprocating saw? I could have sworn there was a new reciprocating saw. Let's look really quick. There has to be a new reciprocating saw. Load more. Dude, they have so many new stuff out. It's crazy. I guess they don't have a new... Like, that might be coming out soon. Let's look that up really quick. Yep, nothing new. Nothing new. So hopefully they they will come out with the reciprocating saw in the future. So I am excited about these tools. We will see how these are once the tools actually sort of arrive. I do want to get that M12 impact driver and test the crap out of that. There's a lot of tools I want to test out. Oh, that came out new with the pipeline. Uh, and so, yeah. So I seriously hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.